So the World Cup ends in real disappointment for England here at Stadium Australia in Sydney, beaten by Spain by a technically superior Spain side who deserve their victory here at Stadium Australia. England were much better in the second half after they changed formation, but really there was too much damage done in that first half when Spain were far superior. It's Spain's first world title, a world championship for Jorge Vilda, who's had a very controversial year, a really sweet moment for him now here in Sydney. And for England, real disappointment. They were so close to adding world glory to their European title, but the wait now goes on for a first English world title for men's or women's football since 1966. Nonetheless, a very good tournament for England, of course, getting to their first final. They really exceeded the expectations that they were with all the injuries that they had. But tonight they can have no complaints. They were simply uh, second best to a very technically gifted Spain team. Mary Oates played very well. Her wonderful penalty save gave England hope. Uh, but it will be a sad journey home now for England who will go home bitterly disappointed that they weren't able to really produce their best football in this final. Uh, Spain are the world champions. It's been a magnificent tournament here in, in Australia and New Zealand. Very well hosted by both nations. A good run for England, but their first defeat in a competitive match under Serena Wiegmann comes in the final and they're heading home as the runners-up.